All right, it says, what two changes happen to the speed of gas molecules if the temperature is increased? And if you haven't watched the previous question with the um, distribution, uh, you might want to do that first. So we're going to use the same um, graph here where we have the molecular speed, okay, on the um, x-axis. So I'm just going to write it as speed down here and the distribution up here. And in this case, we don't have different gases. In the previous case, we had one gas. So let's say we end up with something that looks like this at speed A, all right? Or excuse me, at temperature A. And temperature A is the lower temperature. Now, if we have another graph where we have the speed versus the distribution, and this is for B, and in this case, B is greater than A in terms of their temperature. So B is at a higher temperature. Two things happen. One is we know when we heat this up, it's going to exert a greater pressure. All right. In order for it to exert a greater pressure, the molecules have to speed up on average. So instead of being this average speed, the molecules may speed up like this. So now their new average speed is much higher. But a second thing happens. So it's not just that the average speed increases, it's also the distribution or the range of speeds also increases. The difference between the fastest and the slowest becomes greater. So the range of speeds increases as well as the average speed increases. So those are the two changes that happen.